Nearly 3,000 crashes have been carried out here at Volvo's high-tech crash test laboratory in Gothenburg that this year celebrates its 10-year anniversary. It's in here that Volvo car safety experts and researchers acquire the knowledge that is essential to develop traffic safety and make tomorrow's cars even safer. This is the, the tunnel that is used to conduct both car-to-car -car crashes as well as to crash cars on the outside of the building. So the tunnel here uh, is actually movable on air cushions. It weighs 650 tons and it's movable so we can get any angle on it into the center here from zero to, to 90 degrees. Five, four, three, two, one. This is a car-to-car -car crash that is not required in any safety rating or regulation. We have three X90 cars in this test. The first ever public test with three electric cars in a single sequence. This test recreates a typical real-world scenario when the driver might not be able to see an object and brake in time. The first car runs at 50 km an hour towards the second car, but managed to brake to full stop, just in time, avoiding a collision entirely. The automatic emergency braking, also known as AEB, is an example of the preventive safety features thanks to EX90's advanced sensor set. Then the third car came towards the second car on the side at 55 km per hour. Hitting it in the middle directly towards where the occupants are sitting. The car engaged its strong safety cage, and that helped transfer the loads while managed to deform and absorb the energy from this violent crash. These structures follow the same principles like in the world first technology we introduced in 1991, called the SIPS, Side Impact Protection System. And of course, the side airbags and inflatable curtains were also activated immediately at the impact, and that helps to protect the occupants. In the side impact the X90, we had three crash test dummies. And in the X90 exposed to a frontal crash, we also had three dummies. The energy in this crash test is about 30% higher than the most severe standardized side impact tests required today. 
there would have been no serious injuries according to the data that we collected from these cars and the dummies. In our industry-leading crash laboratory, we could recreate almost any accident in real life. The test today is a great example on how we can cover a wider range of scenarios than what is required to achieve five stars in any rating. It is essential to meet our pioneering safety standard for safety in the real world, so we can create safer cars to better help protect people and accelerate to a future of zero collisions.